Are, are you ready? Yep. I'm going to go live right now. Going live. Hello, everyone. We are live here at the Gulfport Sportsplex here in Gulfport, Mississippi. Glad you can join us here on the SWAC Digital Network here on day one. And Mother Nature has already played a factor. This is field number two. We have two games going on at one time. This game in which it features Alabama A&M and Prairie View. Alabama A&M, the three seed in the east. Prairie View, the two seed in the west. This is game number two. And then on this field, we'll have game number four, Southern and Jackson State. On the opposite field, we'll have Alcorn and Texas Southern. That game coming up here. So to try to stay ahead of Mother Nature, we are on two fields, and we have two fields going right now as we have Alabama A&M, the visiting team. They'll bat first, and Prairie View A&M, the home team. Glad you can join us here on the SWAC Digital Network. I'm Charles Edmond as Prairie View and Alabama A&M. Here's the first pitch, and this misses outside. Ball one, we are underway. Ariel McAtee at the plate, the center fielder for Alabama A&M, coming at 11 and 17 on the season. The hall on the mound, here is the pitch. This misses outside. Two and all the count. We have two games going on at the same time. Grambling and Alabama State, that game 10 minutes in. We've started at 9.04, and at 9.14 we had Lightning. That game is already underway after 10 minutes in. This pitch strike called, two and one, the count. Here in this, the top of the first inning. Here's the two one, a chopper foul off to the left side. And the count is even, two and two, top of the first inning. Scoreless just underway. Two and two the count. Top one. The two two pitch to McAtee and this is slap foul off to the left side. Count remains two and two here in the top of the first inning. Two and two the count. And the pitch, a little dribbler that's fair down the left side. A leadoff single, trying to stretch it into a double, and she does. Ariel McAtee, a leadoff double for Alabama A&M in the top of the first inning. Just slapped it down the left side. Brianna Winchester, the left fielder, stands in for Alabama A&M, so a leadoff double to start this game for the Lady Bulldogs. Glad you can join us here on the SWAC Digital Network. In this bracket, Alabama A&M, Prairie View, Jackson State, Southern. In the same bracket. So a leadoff double by McAtee here in this, the top of the first inning. Square in the butt and pops it up. It's going to be caught at third. One away by Garcia. Trying to lay it down, but she popped it up. One away. So McAtee stays at second. Here's the pitch slap foul off to the right side off the bat of Rachel McKinney. Well, McKinney at the plate with a runner at second. McAtee on the leadoff double. They tried to sacrifice her over and couldn't. The fastball is high. One and one the count. Top of the first inning, two fields being used with the rain and lightning coming in early this morning. 
One and one the count. Top of the first. Off speed, strike called. One and two the count. Good pitch from Hall. One and two the count. Top one, scoreless, the one, two, and this is hit foul, stays alive. Count remains one and two. Maya Hall, the 5'6 freshman from Pomaria, South Carolina, on the mound in the stripes for the Panthers. Here's the one, two. Off speed, low, two and two. With the Gulfport Sportsplex here in Gulfport, Mississippi, new home of the SWAC softball tournament. Glad you can join us on the SWAC Digital Network. I'm Charles Edmond. It's a pleasure to bring you softball action along with James Verrett, who's on the opposite field. Fastball high, and the count is full, three and two. Three and two the count. Top of the first inning, runner at second, one out. Here's the three, two. Inside, ball four. So two on and one out for AM. Here in this, the top of the first inning. It'll bring up the cleanup hitter, Shaylin Charles, the 5'9 freshman from Fayetteville, Arkansas. So two on for Alabama AM. Here's the pitch to Charles, strike called. All in one the count, a leadoff double by McAtee. Winchester, the number two hitter, tried to lay down a button, popped up to third, then a walk to McKinney. So two on and one out. Fastball misses. In the top of the first inning. Here's the 2-1. Misses outside. Three and one the count. Top one. Up two and two. Two and two the count. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. Inside. And she has, has to come back. That make an effort to get out of the way of that one. It's three and two. She probably thought it was time called. And now the runners took off on that pitch. And Preview's head coach Vernon Bland wanted an explanation. The home plate umpire, and he'll come out to talk to the second base umpire. Runners took off on the pitch. They called time. And I wonder if the runners have to go back to second and first. And now the crew will talk it over. So there'll be a discussion to see if it's a stolen base. So will they allowed to get that stolen base? So they have to go back to their respective bases, which would be first and second. We are here in the top of the first inning. Oh, and then they're out. Now time called, and now we have an explanation here from head coach Cassandra Brown. She wants an explanation. Oh, the, leading off the, leaving off the bag. So the runner at second, McKinney is out. So now McAtee double stays at third and there's two out in the inning. So two out runner at third to the DH Charles. 
Here's the pitch, swing and a miss. Well, that was a pitch that she could turn on and couldn't catch up with it. So the count is full, three and two. In the top of the first, was freshman Meyer Hall pitch away from getting out of the inning. But what will Charles do? Here's the three, two. And a late swing, fouled it off to the right. A late swing on the inside pitch and just took it and fought it off to the right side. Count remains three and two. McAtee at third, two out. Top one, scoreless game. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss. Inning over. So this freshman Hall gets out of a jam. A double, runner called out, a walk, and one left for our Alabama A&M. We go to the bottom of the first inning. Scoreless preview coming up to credit repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You have a cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers. That motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. We go to the bottom of the first inning. Lady Panthers of Prairie View A&M. Alabama A&M had an opportunity in the top of the first, a leadoff double, runner left stranded. So Prairie View coming up in the home half of the first. And the first pitch strike called to the leadoff batter, Raleigh Love, the junior from League City, Texas. Here's the pitch to Love, slapped down the left side and it lands foul. Love the right fielder for the Lady Panthers. Prairie View 15 and 14 on the season. One, two, the count, the pitch misses outside. And the count is one and two. Anna Gray is the second baseman on deck. Glad you can join us here on the scoreless ball game here. And this is what is a base hit into left center field. Extra bases all the way to the wall. A double stretched into a triple. She's going to be waved home. The throw home is going to be too late. And inside the park home run. And inside the park home run, let's see if they score at that. Maybe a double and a two base error. We'll see how that is scored. But Love circles the bases. It got by left and center all the way to the wall. And Love circling the bases. We'll see how they score that. A single and a three base error, a double, a two base error. Let's see how they, scare, well, how they score that. But nonetheless, the Panthers with a one nothing lead. Boy, inside the park home run. Let's see if they score that. 
So one nothing Panthers with the lead. Brianna Gray is the senior from Wharton, Texas at the plate. one nothing Prairie View, the pitch inside. Esperanza Coe on the mound for Alabama A&M. one nothing Prairie View. The pitch squares the butt, lays it down, dribbles foul down the left side. So one nothing Prairie View with the lead. There's a shot in the left center. Got all the way to the wall. Love circles the bases. one nothing Prairie View. Here's the pitch, a shot down the left side and lands foul. Her base umpire got in the way of that shot. Two games going on at the same time. Alabama State Grambling, that game was already underway 10 minutes in before Lightning arrived in the area. That game just picked up this game. And then they'll have Texas Southern and Alcorn and Jackson and Southern coming up. Here's the next pitch, swing and a miss. It's gonna be one out. One away. Alyssa Garcia at the plate. Alyssa Garcia, the grad student from Houston. Garcia, the third baseman. One nothing Panthers. Here's the pitch, fastball, strike call, the one one. Kimberly Hernandez on deck. Here's the pitch, misses outside. One and one the count. Here's the one one. This is a pop up on the right side of foul territory and could not be caught. Good effort by the catcher Haley Winter. Preview and inside the park home run by Love. We'll see if they score at that. It may be a single or three base error, a double or two base error. We'll get the official score on that, but nonetheless, the Panthers with the lead, and there's a shot up the middle. It's a base hit off the bat of Garcia. A single for Garcia with one out. It'll bring up Kimberly Hernandez, the senior from Pearland, Texas. Hernandez, the first baseman for the Lady Panthers, who lead one to nothing. This pitch fastball strike from Cole. One nothing Panthers. Here's the pitch a butt. Run it straight back. Foul. Esperanza Co. Nine and seven on the season. Here's the pitch. Fastball misses. One and two the count. Bottom of the first inning. Preview with a one nothing lead. Here's the pitch. Slap foul down the right side. One and two the count. One nothing preview. 
the pitch. Call, third strike. Hernandez caught looking. So two strikeouts by Coe in this inning. Two out. Serena Anton at the plate for Alabama, uh, for Prairie View. This pitch misses outside. Anton, the 5'10 junior from Wharton, Texas. Here's the next pitch, riser high. So an inside the park home run. A couple of strikeouts, a single by Garcia. One nothing Prairie View, bottom one. The pitch from Cole popped up. Right side's gonna land out of play. Right, pretty good crowd has turned out here. Just dealing with the uh, lightning delays. It was more lightning than anything, and that's going to be the issue well, the issue throughout the whole week. It's not going to be the rain because you have turf fields here. It's going to be about the lightning. The pitch from Coe. High. Runner at first, Garcia, one out. And towing at the plate, the pitch. This is a wild pitch, comes back to the catcher. It's going to be a, a wild pitch in Garcia at second. So you've had an inside the park home run, a single and a wild pitch. The Panthers. And it'll bring up Jay Williams, the 5'4 junior from Dakula, Georgia. There's the pitch swing and a miss. Williams, the DH. Bottom one, two on. Alabama AM at a leadoff double. Runner left stranded. Panthers have two on here in the first. Foul off to the right side. Williams, during the season, hit 226. Five RBIs for Williams during the year. This pitch swing and a miss. Inning over. Three strikeouts by Coe, but a run. Two hits and one left for preview as they lead one nothing. We'll take a break. We'll be right back with the top of the second inning here on the SWAC Digital credit repair company to fix my credit hold the phone man you can do it yourself with credit versio that's way too hard call the credit repair company most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time making it slow and expensive you won't figure that out for months <laughs> ignore him credit versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus finds the accounts that are hurting your score and guides you through the entire process anyone can do it let's fast forward and see the results <laughs> wow i fixed my own credit and saved hundreds you can do this visit creditversio.com your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stan. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers. That motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Back here live in Gulfport, Mississippi. Fans sitting uh, out behind the offense in left field. Fans here along the grandstands behind the first and third base lines. 
And I got to give the SWAC and uh, Commissioner Dr. Charles McClellan and folks behind the scenes a heck of a job in pivoting because we initially had scheduled just four games on one field, but lightning and rain changed our plans. Esperanza Coe leads it off for Alabama A&M. Here in the top of the second inning. A&M had a leadoff double in the first. Left the runner stranded. Oh, pops this one up in foul territory. Is there a play? No, just lands beyond the netting. To the left of the dugout for Alabama A&M. Esperanza Coe, 313 average during the season with 17 runs batted in. Got a chance to watch her in the Alcorn series where she had a couple of home runs. Here's the pitch inside, a check swing. Top of the second inning. One nothing Prairie View with the lead. They officially scored. Here's the pitch, a check swing. As they check at first, did not go around. They officially gave Love a triple and an error. Talk with the official score in between half innings. So a triple and an error is the official score on that shot by Love. Here's the pitch, riser high and outside. Kind of figure it's either going to be a double and a two base error, a triple and an error. And the thinking is that she was going to have a triple anyway, going all the way to the wall. And then the error, of course, brought her in. Here's the pitch, fouled off to the right side. Prairie View stranded two in the bottom of the first. Full count to Coe. Coe, Alyssa Lopez, and Taylor Woods in the top of the second inning. The 3-2. Inside, ball four. The second walk issued by Hall. Second baseman number 42, Alyssa Lopez. So Alyssa Lopez stands in. So second inning in a row, the leadoff batter's been on. Lopez hit 237 during the season with eight runs batted in. The pitch to Lopez, strike call, lower one. The top of the second inning here in Gulfport, Mississippi, the Gulfport Sportsplex. One nothing, Prairie View. Pitch in for a strike. Just caught the outer half. And there's 0 and 2. The 0 2 pitch just misses outside. Alabama AM. Coming in the three seed in the east. Here's the pitch low. Wild pitch. And a very short backstop. It came back to the catcher. But the wild pitch allows Coe to get to second base. So AM with opportunities, runners in scoring position in the first two innings. Hall gets the sign and brings it home. Swing and a miss. One away. And that's the second strikeout by Maya Hall. So Hall has struck out two in his walk two. It'll bring up the shortstop Taylor Woods. Taylor Woods, a sophomore from Decatur, Alabama. 
Here's the pitch strike call to Taylor Woods. Off speed, slapped in the left field for a base hit. All being held up at third. So here comes the Lady Bulldogs. They have runners on at first and third. Cole walked, a wild pitch got her to second, and a single moves her to third. Taylor Woods, a one-out single. Serena Herbranson at the plate, the third baseman. For a and they have first and third, one out. Panthers with a one-nothing lead. And Branson square in the bunch. She has a strike and a throw, and she's out! Woods caught stealing. And that's the second out. All of one the count. A Branson at 271 during the season. His pitch strike called. Count is 0-2. Let's go, Let's go. Here's the 0-2. Swing and a miss. Inning is over. So for the second inning in a row, the leadoff man is on for Alabama A&M and left stranded. So you have a walk, a single, runner caught stealing, one stranded for A&M. They've left two. We go to the home half of the second inning. And Alabama repair company to fix my credit hold the phone man you can do it yourself with credit versio that's way too hard call the credit repair company most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time making it slow and expensive you won't figure that out for months <laughs> ignore him credit versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus finds the accounts that are hurting your score and guides you through the entire process anyone can do it let's fast forward and see the results <laughs> wow i fixed my own credit and saved hundreds you can do this visit creditversio.com your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You have a cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers that motivates me today. To focus on my future, we are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. All right, welcome back. Glad you can join us here on the SWAC Digital Network. We got a couple of games going on at the same time. Alabama State leads Grambling 3-0 on our opposite field. Glad you can join us here. Top of the second here. Cameron Laverne at the plate for the Lady Panthers. Cameron Laverne, the grad student from Houston, Booker T. Washington, school Trinity University transfer. Laverne hit 286 during the season. The first pitch strike called from Coe. Preview with a 1 0 lead, a triple and an error allowed Love to circle the bases. They foul off to the right side. Next pitch call, third strike on the inside corner. Three straight strikeouts by Coe. She's got four for the game. Oh, 
Center fielder number 20, Natalie McClellan. Oh, I'm trying to bunt and bunts it foul. On the count, Natalie McClellan, the senior from Houston, is pitch inside. And this is a shot in the center. It's going to be a sliding catch in center field. Nice catch there to end the inning. Good job in center by McAtee. Shortstop number two, Gabrielle Fonseca. Gabrielle Fonseca at the plate. Two out. This pitch right down the middle, strike called. Well, Cole with the shades looking really nice. The shades on. And she is just so dangerous on the mound and with a bat in her hand. It's a fly ball, shallow right, caught at second. And the side is retired. So that takes care of Prairie View as Alyssa Lopez hauls it in. So we'll take a break. Two credit repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers that motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Y'all right? Good, good. All right, welcome back. We are live here in Gulfport, Mississippi. The Gulfport Sportsplex. Glad you can join us. Couple of games going on at one time. Grambling, Alabama State. We just had a home run hit over there. Haley Winter at the plate, nine, one, and two. Winner, then top of the lineup, McAtee and Winchester. Winner at the plate. Top of the third inning. The pitch swing and a miss. We're underway here in this third inning. Winner hit 202 during the season. The riser is high, one ball and one strike to count. Couple of more games here on the Swag Digital Network. Of course, we'll have all the games from start to finish right here on the network. Yours truly, James Verrett, included in the calls. Here's the pitch, fouled straight back. The count is one and two. Haley Winner.
Here's the pitch. Check swing, just missed. Count is two and two. Alabama A&M from Huntsville, Alabama. Two and two the count. The pitch popped up. Right side, down the line. It's gonna be caught at second. One down as Grays hauls it in. One away. Ariel McAtee doubled, stranded the last time up. Alabama A&M's had the leadoff man on the first two innings. McAtee led off with a double, was stranded, and then Cohen the second led off with a walk and was at second. Eventually got to third and she was stranded. Here's a shot to left and quickly two away. Hauled in by Laverne. Left fielder number three, Brianna Winchester. Winchester stands in. Brianna Winchester wide to third her last time up. As the pitch misses outside, ball one. One and all the count. Outside for a strike, one and one. Pitch foul back. And the count is one and two. So Hall, a pitch away from getting out of this top three. Next pitch misses. The next pitch, and this is fouled off to the left side. So they want some good crowds here. A lot of car cars, good crowds have turned out here so far. Day one, battling the weather, we had lightning. That was the issue, not necessarily rain, but lightning, and a lot of it this morning and early afternoon. The pitch, this is a shot up the middle, took it right up the middle, and it's a base hit. Off the bat of Winchester. Third hit for a and Mitchell McKinney stands in. In the Eastern Division, Jackson State won the East by virtue of Alcorn's loss last regular season weekend to Bama State. The Lady Braves actually controlled the East it's a fastball high and outside, ball one. By virtue of a series win over Jackson State, the Lady Braves did not play Valley, which was scheduled for last weekend. Therefore, Jackson State won the East. This is the two and three seeds here. This pitch, strike call. The Braves feature the hitter of the Hitter of the year in the Southwestern Athletic Conference. Here's the next pitch, a little flare. It's gonna be caught behind home plate. And the side is retired as Antone hauls it in. And that takes care of Alabama a and A hit and one left. We'll take a break here. And when we come back with the bottom of the third inning, Alabama, uh, Prairie View will have the top of the lineup coming up after this on the SWAC Digital Network.
credit repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers. That motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. All right, bottom of the third inning. Panthers with a one nothing lead, a triple and an air off the bat of really love to lead it off of the Panthers. And she's up here in the bottom of the third inning. It was a shot to left center field, got all the way to the wall. She circled the bases. They ruled it a triple and an error. And the assumption is that she was going to get a triple anyway. We're underway in the bottom of the third inning. A check swing, pitches inside, ball one. Love, Grays, and Garcia. Bottom three. This pitch, a ground ball foul. One thing about the softball tournament as well as the baseball tournament with the brackets, you have matchups that you don't typically see during the regular season. Don't have a lot of information on your opponent. And that's, uh, I mean, you do have some matchups during the regular season, like a Grambling Jackson State because of the close proximity. But otherwise, you know, a matchup like this, you just don't see in the regular season. There's a one hopper back to Cole. If you're scoring at home, one three, one out. Gray struck out her last time up. Second baseman number 13, Brianna Gray. Oh, a grand slam home run just hit. Two home runs on that opposite field. There's a bunt. Third baseman and Cole kind of miscommunication there. Cole was going to get it. Third baseman said she had it. Cole picked it up, but it was too late. A bunt single for Grays. Third baseman number one, Alyssa Garcia. Is the runner going and the tag, and she's out as Gray's caught stealing. Well, Gray's giving the green light right away. And the count is 1 0. Well, both teams aggressive on the bases here in the early going. One out, base is empty. It's a shot in the center field. Caught in center. Two away as T hauls it in, and that takes no care hits, of no no Braveview. None left. So a bunt single, a runner caught stealing, and nobody left. So we'll take a break. Our score, one nothing. Braveview with a one nothing lead. And when we come back, 
And the top of, of the fourth inning for Alabama A&M, Charles Cohen Lopez, four, five, and six, coming up after this. Credit repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's Mega Sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun Mega Sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights because my history is forged by trailblazers that motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Four, five, and six for Alabama A&M. Well, some excitement on that opposite field. A couple of home runs, including a grand slam hit. We'll talk about the individuals on the all-conference team coming up. Charles struck out her last time up. She stands in. Pitches inside. Underway, top four, one nothing Prairie View. Amari Ramsey of Alcorn, named hitter of the year. We'll see Alcorn coming up next in their game with Texas Southern. The Lady Braves, the four seed in the east, Texas Southern, the one seed in the west. Alabama State's Madison Myers was selected newcomer of the year and Esperanza Co. freshman of the year. Here's the pitch. We got a miss on a riser. Pitch swing and a miss. A couple of risers. Some heat there. Charles couldn't catch up with it. Pitcher One away. Four strikeouts by this pitcher, Hall. One away. Co, the freshman of the year at the plate. Pitch swing and a miss. Cole Walker last time up, advanced on a wild pitch, was stranded. One-one the count. Top four. Riser is high. Talk about the uh, play of the year, all corns Amari Ramsey, the 15th member of the program's 100 hit club. Pitch is high. Coe's earned weekly conference player of the week honors five times, three times player of the week and twice as the pitcher of the week. She fouls it back. And she started all 27 games. And has a 313 average. 
and tied for the league lead with five home runs. So not only is she dangerous on the mound, but I've personally seen her hit a couple of the five home runs that she hit this year. And she definitely has to be respected at the plate. Two and two the count. Top of the fourth inning. One nothing preview. The 2-2. Two -two. Inside, so Cole walked for the second time. It's the third walk issued by Hall. So one on, one out, Lopez struck out her last time up. Foul back off the bat of Lopez. Texas Southern Alcorn coming up next. Southern Jackson State coming up next. All on the SWAC Digital Network. Pitch to pitch, wall to wall coverage all week long. The pitch strike called. We had lightning issues this morning. The weather will improve as we get to later in the week. Come Friday, I think we'll be okay weather-wise. This pitch called third strike. That's the fifth strikeout by Hall. Taylor Woods at the plate. This pitch swing and a miss. She singled and caught stealing her last time up. We're in the top of the fourth inning. Prairie View with a one nothing lead. The first batter for Prairie View, Grayley Love. A triple circled the bases on an error. And that's the only score so far. Next pitch just misses. AM is at base runners in every inning. Two of the three previous innings, they've had runners on base. Both teams have left two. Next pitch, swing and a miss, and six strikeouts by Hall. So we have played three and a half. Lady Panthers trying to add to their one-nothing lead with Hernandez, Antone, and Williams coming up repair company to fix my credit hold the phone man you can do it yourself with credit versio that's way too hard call the credit repair company most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time making it slow and expensive you won't figure that out for months <laughs> ignore him credit versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus finds the accounts that are hurting your score and guides you through the entire process anyone can do it let's fast forward and see the results <laughs> wow i fixed my own credit and saved hundreds you can do this visit creditversio.com your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's Mega Sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun Mega Sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers. 
that motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Bottom of the fourth inning. Charles Edmond here, James Verrett on the opposite field. It's got a lot of action over there, just the opposite here. One nothing. Panthers. Hernandez, Anton Williams, the middle of the lineup. Facing Co. This ball's well hit. Slight wind blowing out. Caught in center by McAtee. We're underway here in the home half of the fourth inning. Catcher number 16, Serena Anton. Tone struck out the last time up. Square in the bunt, takes a pitch high and inside, ball one. Teams arrived here yesterday and just trying to get practice in amongst all the weather, off and on rain. Some got some work in, some uh, was kind of tough sledding. This has popped up. A lot of pop-ups in this game, behind second. Caught by the shortstop, Woods. Designated hitter number 31, Jay Williams. Yeah, Williams struck out her last time up. Well, between these two pitchers, Hall and Coe, Tons of strikeouts. Coe has struck out five. Hall has struck out six, so 11 strikeouts. The riser high. So both teams, both pitchers kind of found a rhythm. Two away. Bottom four. Bunt takes a pitch outside. Coming up next here on the SWAC Digital Network, Jackson State and Southern, Alcorn, Texas Southern. Here's the next pitch. And this is And nobody could field it. Catcher, first baseman, pitcher, third baseman, they all just looked at it. They all met at a point and no one could make a play. So a bunt single by Williams. Left fielder, number 21, Cameron Laverne. We've had a couple of plays on the infield that Alabama A&M had not made on the infield. Cameron Laverne struck out her last time up. Square in the butt. Makes a pitch outside. On the second team, Brianna Grace. Second team, second baseman for Prairie View. Lisa Garcia, third all-conference second team, third baseman. Cameron Laverne on the second team. And she hits this one foul. And Natalie McLennan, Brave you in the outfield, second team. Bottom four, day one, 2021 SWAC softball tournament here in Gulfport. The Gulfport Sportsplex. Wind blowing out at the moment. This is fouled straight back. One and two the count. Well, this game ahead of the game behind us, they're just getting into the bottom of the fourth. Here's the one, two. Fouled it straight back.
It's definitely going to be a warm weekend here with this natural, with this artificial turf. Sun radiates. Runner going, and the tag, and it's too late. Let's see if they rule that a stolen base. A wild pitch stolen base, the count is two and two. So the Panthers with the runner in scoring position. They've left two runners on. Pitch from Coe. The dribbler to first. And the toss to second, three to four, and the side is retired, and the Panthers do, in fact, strand no their no third hits. runner. No One left. We go to the fifth. One nothing, our score. Preview with a one nothing lead. Eight, nine, and one. Her Branson Winter on top of the order. McAtee coming up for Alabama A&M. Credit repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers. That motivates me today. To focus on my future, we are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Well, our producer, Alan Mays, first time working with Alan Mays. Trying to get our timing down. You know, first time for everything is uh, is always a little off kilter. But we're getting it down. Alan Mays, our producer. Charles Edmond here on the SWAC Digital Network. Glad you can join us. Top of the fifth inning. We're underway. Our Branson struck out our last time up, followed by Healy Winter. And then top of the lineup, Ariel McAtee, 8-9-1. Coming up for AM. Our base umpire looks at the scuffed up softball, looks at it, rotates it around, and says it's okay. Play on. And Alabama State leads Grambling 11 to nothing through four. There is a, a rule in softball, eight runs through five innings <clears throat> there. So Grambling's got to get it. Grambling's got to at least get four runs in the bottom of the fifth. Grambling's got a first-year head coach as well. Pitch inside, ball one. Underway here in the top of the fifth inning. As a dribbler to third. Oh, low and out at first. A little bit offline. A good job at first as Garcia rolls it over to Hernandez. Five to three, one away. Number nine hitter Haley Winter stands in. Fly to second her last time up. One to nothing. Panthers scored in the bottom of the first. A leadoff hitter Love. A shot to the wall. And then an error allowed her to circle the bases. So a triple and an error. And that's the only run so far. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 
Winner digs in. A pitch from Hall. The third, two out. Top of the lineup for AM. McAtee doubled wide to left. She's one for two. Eleven to nothing, Bama State over Grambling. This pitch misses. Grambling's got to get at least four runs in the bottom of the fifth inning to extend that game. Hall gets the sign. Jumper to short. Inning over. One, two, three, inning. Three ground ball outs, two to third, one to short. Four and a half complete, one nothing. Panthers are coming up in the bottom of the fifth inning with eight, nine, and one. Coming up after this, timeout on the SWAC Digital Network. Repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's Mega Sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun Mega Sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers that motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Back here in Gulfport, Mississippi, along the coast of Mississippi, Gulfport, Biloxi, not too far from Mobile. It's an honor and a pleasure to bring you the SWAC softball tournament. We've been in different venues, Irondale, Alabama, Alabama State. Enjoy those venues. This is bunted straight back here. Like Irondale, you had several fields. In Irondale, you had a couple of fields. We're glad to be here with the turf can handle the rain, but lightning, another issue. We had a lightning delay, and the games were delayed until about 4 o'clock. This pitch is low. <laughs> McClellan fly to center last time up. That's from the freshman of the year. Check over it first to see if she went. She did not. Here's a shot at the base hit in the left field. McClellan, a single. Runner now on first from Lady Panthers, and up next to bat is shortstop, number two, Gabriela Fonseca. It's the fifth hit for preview. Gabriel Fonseca, the number nine hitter, stands in. Home half of the fifth inning. Panthers trying to add to their lead. Square in the bunt, lays it down, a good bunt. The throw to first is there. The runner trying to get to third and the throw on the tag and she's safe. 
So aggressive running by McClellan, motored all the way to third. Runner advances to third for the Lady Panthers, and next up is number six, Riley Love. So the sack is good, and McClellan to third. So Love stands in, and Prairie View, a chance to add to their one nothing lead. Strike called. Love tripled, scored on an error, grounded back to the pitcher. So the Panthers already with a one nothing lead and have a runner at third with one out. Chopper to second, and the run scores. So Love, both of the RBIs, two to nothing. So two out, bases empty for Brianna Gray's home half of the fifth inning. Preview will get the winner of Jackson State and Southern. That game coming up next. Preview with a 2 0 lead, bottom five. Off of Co. Freshman of the year in the conference. There's the pitch low. Pitch outside. So a, a single by McClellan. Sacrifice to the right side off the bat of Fonseca. McClellan got to third. Then a ground ball to second, drove her in. Two nothing preview. There's a shot off of Cole. Can't make the play. We'll see what they say. It's gonna be a base hit. They call it a single. Next up for Lady Panthers is number one, Alyssa Garcia. So Alyssa Garcia stands in. Garcia singled and fly to center. Misses outside. <laughs> Fly ball to center, and it'll end the inning. So a run on two hits. And they strand one. So the Panthers have left four. And we played five. Panthers with a 2 nothing lead. When we come back, the heart of the lineup, 2-3-4 and four with Winchester, McKinney, and Charles due up in the sixth. We'll be back after this. A repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's Mega Sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun Mega Sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers that motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage.
Our producer, Alan Mays. I'm Charles Edmond here in Gulfport, Mississippi. We go to the top of the sixth. Brianna Winchester. One for two stands in. Panthers with a run in the first, a run in the fifth. They're up two to nothing. Winchester one for two stands in. Pitch misses outside. Maya Hall. Six strikeouts. She's given up three hits. This pitch misses outside. Two nothing, very much a ball game. AM needs a runner or two on base. The ball is short. Away. Back to back assists. Well, the Prairie View shortstop, Fonseca. Next up is first baseman number 11, Rachel McKinney. Six straight set down by this pitcher, Hall. Rachel McKinney walked and fouled out, stands in. 2 nothing Prairie View. Top of the sixth. There's a shot foul down the left side. Uh, won the count. Good pitch, strike call, 0 and 2. Oh and 2 the count. This pitch inside. Check swing, didn't go around. Kid, 1 and 2. 1 and 2 the count. Top of the sixth inning, preview with a 2 nothing lead on AM. The 1 2 off speed call, third strike. That is the seventh strikeout by Maya Hall. Two out. Shaylen Charles. Two of the seven strikeouts stands in. Two nothing. Review this pitch swing and a miss. All one the count. Top of the sixth. The Alabama A and M. It's the Alabama A and M team. Trying to figure out a way. Here's a ground ball to second. Inning over. Eight in a row set down by Hall. Five and a half completes. Brave you with a two nothing lead trying to add to it with Hernandez, Antone, and Williams coming up after this timeout. We'll have the bottom of the sixth inning. Repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's mega sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun mega sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us. 
to great heights because my history is forged by trailblazers that motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Prairie View coming to bat, trying to add to their 2 nothing lead. A&M, freshman of the year, Co. trying to keep her team right where it is to set them up for the seventh. Underway in the bottom of the sixth inning. Hernandez 0 for 2, struck out, fly to center. Kimberly Hernandez will be followed by Serena Antone and J.O. Williams, 5, 6, and 7 in the lineup. Our producer to my right, Alan Mays, here on the SWAC Digital Network. I'm Charles Edmond. Glad you can join us. Base hit in the right center. Slapped it with some depth. Long single for Hernandez. Seventh hit for Prairie View. We might either have a pinch hitter or a pinch runner here. Well, Antone at the plate, so we'll have a pinch runner. And pinch running at first base for the Lady Panthers is number Destiny two. Smith, the freshman Destiny from Smith. Seabrook, Texas, pinch running. So Smith in for Hernandez. First substitution for either side here in this game. So Antone at the plate, maybe a little speed on the bases. Could be a sack situation for Prairie View. Up square in a bunt, takes a pitch high and outside. Well, Prairie View trying to put the runner in scoring position. Maybe a situation where Alabama a has to feel the ball and you have speed at first, trying to get to third. That's how Prairie View got their second run. There's a bunt off the plate. That was one and one. A couple of games coming up here on the Swag Digital Network, Jackson State Southern. And here on this field, Alcorn and Texas Southern coming up. There's the pitch low. The bunt fielded, throws is there. Pretty good bunt, 5-3 on the sacrifice. Or Branson. 5-3 sacrifice. Smith, the pinch runner, at second. J.O. Williams. One for two, a bunt single, stole a base and struck struck out. <laughs> Popped up. Caught it second. By Lopez. Cameron Laverne struck out, grounded out. Well, the Panthers have left four. Have a runner at second. Off speed misses, ball one. As we look ahead to the top of the seventh inning, Esperanza Coe will lead it off, followed by Alyssa Lopez and Taylor Woods. Top of the seventh inning. There's a little flare, caught it second. 
side is retired. Caught it second by Lopez. And Prairie View strands their fifth runner. And we go to the seventh inning. Two to nothing. Panthers with a two nothing lead. Cole, Lopez, and Woods coming up. Last chance for AM here in the top of the seventh inning. We'll be right back. A repair company to fix my credit. Hold the phone, man. You can do it yourself with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time, making it slow and expensive. You won't figure that out for months. <laughs> Ignore him. Credit Versio's brilliant software scans all three credit bureaus, finds the accounts that are hurting your score, and guides you through the entire process. Anyone can do it. Let's fast forward and see the results. <laughs> wow, I fixed my own credit and saved hundreds. You can do this. Visit creditversio.com. Your mom's been posting a lot since she got that phone at Cricket's Mega Sale. Every day. Here's a comment. We stand. Oh, mom. You're the cool mom. <laughs> the more phone, more fun Mega Sale. Mega. We are the swag. Our heritage lifts us to great heights. Because my history is forged by trailblazers. That motivates me today to focus on my future. We are the SWAC. We are the new trailblazers. And this is my heritage. Here in Gulfport, we had to make some changes. A couple of games going on at one time, trying to get caught up. On this field, it will be Texas Southern and Alcorn. And the field behind me will be Jackson State and Southern, I believe, coming up here next. Alabama State beat Grambling in the first final of the day. So Grambling, Alabama State will take on the winner of Alcorn, Texas Southern. Our co has walked twice. But this pitcher Hall is set down eight in a row. We are in the top of the seventh inning. Two to nothing, our score. This ball inside. Pitch to Coe is low. I don't think they're going to give Coe because she's got seven home runs. I don't think they're going to give her anything to hit. She's already walked twice. But all AM needs is a base runner to bring the potential tying run to the plate. And she was trying to cut the lead in half with that swing. Two to nothing, low scoring game here. The Panthers got a run in the first, a triple in an air as Love circled the bases. And there's the pitch ball four. They were not gonna mess around with Coe. She has walked for the third time. Four walks three. issued by Hall. Three of them have been to Coe. And now we're going to get, I uh, believe, a pinch hitter. A pinch runner. Yep, a pinch runner for Coe. It's a little speed on the bases. I mean, the potential tying run is at the plate. So a and at least wants to put themselves in position to get on the board. Pitch running at first base for the Lady Bulldogs is Aaliyah Harrison. Leah Harrison, the freshman. Here's a bunt. Here's a throw over to second, and she's out. Well, they got the lead runner. So five to six on the fielder's choice. Interesting that they would get the lead runner. So the fielder's choice, and Lopez at first. 
So runner at first, one out again. The potential tying run of the plate, Taylor Woods, single, caught stealing, and struck out. Two to nothing, Prairie View, top of the seventh. Pitch misses. Foul back. This is the bottom of the lineup for Alabama A&M. Two to nothing, Prairie View. Time run at the plate. Off speed, misses. is high. So two walks in this inning. The fifth walk issued by Hall. Tying run at the at first. The go ahead run is at the plate and number eight hitter Sabrina Habranson. She's 0 for 2. Struck out and grounded to third. Here's a shot down the left side. It's going to land foul. Just foul by about a foot and a half down the left side. On one, one the count. Go ahead, run at the plate for Alabama AM. Well, Branson 0 for 2. 2 0 our score. There's a fly ball in the deep center field. Going to be caught in center. Two out. Two out, two on. AM has left two. Haley Winter. This will be the 100th pitch coming up for Hall. Hundred pitch coming up. Two on, two out. Strike called. Well, if the Panthers get this final out, they will play the winner of Jackson and Southern coming up tomorrow at six. Pitch is low. Runner trying to get back to second, and she does. Well, Alabama State beat Grambling, so Bama State will play at 3 o'clock tomorrow against the winner of Texas Southern and Alcorn. That game coming up next on this field here on the SWAC Digital Network. Pitch foul straight back. Hall a pitch away from putting the Panthers into the winner's bracket. Alabama State has won. Prairie View a pitch away from winning. Here's the pitch. Poked it to first. Side retired, and that's your ball game. Ladies and gentlemen, that's the ball game. The Prairie View and Lady Panthers. Prairie View will take on the winner of Jackson State and Texas Southern tomorrow. And for Alabama a&M that puts them in the loser's bracket for Alabama A&M. They're going to have to rally 
in a big way tomorrow. And they'll play tomorrow at noon. So that'll do it here as the Panthers win two to nothing. They score a run in the first and a run in the fifth. A triple and an error off the bat of Love. She circles the bases. And then a sacrifice. And scoring a run is Hernandez for the second run. And Maya Hall, 103 pitches, and it held up as the Panthers win by the count of two to nothing. Glad you can join us. Coming up next, it will be Alcorn and Texas Southern, the four seed in the east, the one seed in the west. That's coming up next here on the SWAC Digital Network. For our producer, Alan Mays, I'm Charles Edman. Glad you can join us. Final here, Prairie View 2, Alabama A&M, nothing. Up next. Texas Southern and all corn. That's next here on the Swag Digital Network. So long. Repair company to fix my credit. Self with Credit Versio. That's way too hard. Call the credit repair company. Most credit repair companies only work on one or two accounts at a time.